Good evening. Um, tonight I don't have a rod, I'm not, not doing any fishing, but um, I wanted to talk about a very serious um, gripe that I have with the fishermen around Australia, but in particular the fishermen around the area that I'm living and I'm fishing. I stopped fishing up at um, Bowen Creek Bowen Drain uh, a few days ago because there was a stinky rotten pile of carp. It's a public park. That's not doing any of us any favours. I copped a few comments about the smell and about dead fish floating around in the lake. And I'm pretty annoyed about it because I let go all the fish I catch. If I don't, for whatever reason, be it a red fin that's necked the hook or whatever, I take it with me. The ridiculous part is, where the pile of stinky dead fish was, there's a bin less than 100 metres away. 100 metres. Now, I've been fishing Kingston Foreshore last couple of days, Thursday night. Beautiful. Friday night, guess what I found? I found a stinky dead pile of carp. There's one too. There's a big one there. Nice big fish. There's one buried under the rocks there. Obviously someone's had a field day. There's another one over here with a pile of rocks on it. This, guys, is beyond despicable. That is a retail, uh, uh, that's a residential um, housing block. That's a pile of dead, stinky carp. Those are restaurants. Directly across on the far end of the bridge there, there is three big bins. Why? Seriously, why? If you're not going to take them with you... Oh, there's another fish. I didn't see that one. Under that rock there. They're everywhere. If you're not going to take them with you, don't kill them. In the ACT, it is not required that you kill carp. That's a fallacy. Does this look anything like a natural environment? Are we protecting a natural environment by killing piles of carp and stinking out the neighbourhood? Seriously? This has got to stop, guys. Because otherwise we're going to start turning up to places and finding signs saying no fishing. They're not going to put bins in, they're not going to, you know, make it easy for us to dispose of fish. They're just going to stop us from fishing. So how about we rethink this policy that every bloody-minded Australian has, that carp are belong dead on the bank, and start returning them to the water if you're not going to take them. Because, the funny thing is, you're not helping. You're not doing a thing for the environment. If every single Australian caught 10 carp today, it wouldn't impact their numbers. Every single Australian, man, woman and child, would not impact their numbers at all. So please, Stop with this gratuitous slaughter, this stinking, stinking up of public areas and this stinking up of my favourite fishing places. It's ridiculous. Beyond ridiculous. It's despicable. And I think you're all a bunch of fools. If I see you doing it, I'll tell you what, I'll be calling you out in public for it.
public park. People are going past, they're complaining at me because I'm fishing here. And some dickhead has come along and thought they're doing the great thing by killing a pile of carp and leaving it. This makes me so angry. There's two more stinking and rotting bloated fish up here in the drain. You're going to be a dickhead that kills all the carp that you keep, that, that, that you catch, instead of just letting them go. You think you're doing the good thing? Well, that is not a good thing. That stinking fucking carp over there is not a good thing. That pile of carp over there is not a good thing. You haven't done anything for the environment, you're just a dickhead. Thanks for coming.